Hi guys, well let's take a look at the legend character once more. Uh, this time let's take a look at Amon Sor. Essentially he's the son of Abin Sor, but he became a Yellow Lantern as opposed to being a Green Lantern. Essentially he blames Hal Jordan for the death of his father. Uh, Abin Sor, if you don't know, is the, the, the Green Lantern who gave his ring to uh, Hal Jordan when he passed away. So, and uh, Amon Sir is uh, the son of the guy who gave the ring to Hal Jordan, if it makes any sense. If you guys saw the movies or, or if you saw any of the origin uh, for Green Lantern, you, you know who Abin Sir is. So, let's get started with our friend Amon Sir. So, essentially, he's using uh, martial arts. And also, if we look at his powers, uh, he's, using, he's using the Light Claws, which is uh, pretty much uh, standard at, with uh, the, the Yellow Lantern powers. He's using uh, the Ram, uh, the Construct Whirlwind. Uh, this one, I don't recall what that is. Uh, he's using Shatter, Nightmare Construct, Swoop Attack, and ob obviously the Solar Cola and the Breakout Trinket. So let's start with the powers, but let's pull back a bit so that we can see what's, uh, what's going on, what is what. So the first one is pretty simple. It's uh, pretty much the same clause uh, as, as usual. Although we don't seem to have uh, quite the same uh, combo. We just we can just uh, hit a few times uh, with the claw. That's pretty much it. We can't... Uh, we can't... Uh... One, two, three, four. Uh, we can use we can use the claws uh, just a bit, but we can't we can't really do like a finisher move uh, if we if we try to switch his to martial arts. So that's it for the claws. The ram obviously the same thing as uh, the traditional uh, green lantern one. Obviously, there's no no combos. So let's try the next one. So essentially, you see that sort of whirling effect. A monster cannot move when that happens. So you're pretty much locked into place, and uh, you watch that the nice uh, whirlwing, uh, whirly effect around your character, which uh, seems to damage uh, and more or less knock back, uh, unless they resist. Uh, nah, it doesn't really knock knock them out, or so it just uh, just some sort of whirlwing effect that seems to stun a bit and uh, do a bit of damage. So, and the last one is. A pretty long animation, as you saw, where you hit the ground and uh, more or less, it seems to affect only one player, one character. Hard to tell. And then the next one is uh, you summon a, a construct, essentially, that will help you in battle. I could have sworn the construct looked nothing like this uh, in the past, but it's been a long time since I used them once, or maybe I'm just... Uh, misremembering or maybe they did change uh, the, the actual uh, construct with time well I could have sworn he looked uh, he looked different and of course we have the all-powerful uh, swoop attack that a lot of flyer uh, flying characters have I guess it's a uh, one of those abilities that the devs uh, really really enjoy although it is it is pretty useful in PvP when your enemies try to run away you can catch up to them uh, quick uh, using that although you can also use the light claws to to catch up to them. Uh, it's almost as good as the the swoop attack. So and let's look at this. Uh, that is a uh, weapon combos. Essentially, there's the obligatory uh, hold the, the square which essentially makes you lunge uh, towards an opponent. There's the powerful knee attack, known, also known as knee lunge, but I, I call it the powerful knee attack because uh, for some reason I started calling it that and it's it stuck uh, in my head. Don't ask why. So essentially two tap one hold is that sort of cartwheel kick. Oh, one tap too many. So, and the three tap, one hold, that's going to be the elbow drop. Oh, one tap too many. So essentially, as you see, even if your timing is off sometimes, 
you will still do a combo. Of course, if you need a specific combo at an appropriate time, you, you'd better make sure that your timing is off, is right. And uh, as you saw, the fourth, uh, four tap one one hold, it's the spinning punch. So let's go ahead and do that. And you have that nice uh, yellow lantern animation on the floor, what happens. And of course, the smoke bomb thingy with the five tap one hold. The smoke bomb, oh, it's just smoke bomb, okay. So it kind of stands uh, pretty much everyone uh, fairly close to your character. And of course you have the uh, the ranged attack which is hold, 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 and hold, hold, hold. So let's try them all. So hold, that's the first one. Pretty, pretty simple. It's also your block breaker, although I think they all block break. We'll see. Hold and hold. So that block breaks also. Well, let's try it again. Hold, hold, hold. So pretty much all of those uh, seems to be block breaker. So and again, if you just press the triangle, you're going to, uh, you're going to throw a shuriken, which also, as you can see, is a is a block breaker. So that's pretty much it for Amansur. So let's try the powers one more time. So that's the for the light claws. For the ram. Again, pretty straightforward. For the swirling thingy, again, uh, pretty pretty straightforward. For the uber mega long animation thingy, uh, sadly you, you you see that coming uh, like a mile away, so you have plenty of time to block. Although uh, I wouldn't be surprised if it uh, if it cannot be blocked. Um, we're gonna have to try it in uh, in battle. So obviously, and again, the construct. I didn't notice how long he lasts, but I guess he lasts a, a bit, a, a short bit of the cooldown. And of course, the almighty swoop attack that every every flying character has. So I guess we're going to take a quick look at a look at how long uh, our friend uh, the construct uh, lasts. We're past uh, the quarter of the cooldown, so let's keep going. So it lasts a little more than the quarter, not quite half of the cooldown. So once you once you know that, you can more or less gauge uh, how long the, the construct will be there to help you out. And that's pretty much it for our friend uh, Amonsur. Holy crap! It looks uh, looks really dark in, uh, in this room, but it doesn't really matter. The, the lighting is not why uh, we need this room. So that's it for now, guys. So thanks for watching, and hopefully I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.